up, Biatch! I'm motherfucking Rick! Rick? Rick Sanchez? Uh, we, 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 we kind of hijacked your time slot back in, back on April 1st. It, it was, it was kind of a dick move. Uh, uh, th then again, the, the airing did delay your girlfriend's inevitable demise. So yeah, you're welcome. What? Huh? Oh, you lack fourth wall awareness. Interesting. Ooh, ooh, uh, isn't there an episode where some kid sang the Will I Am theme song? I, I, I don't mean to be that guy, but I, it's, it seems like an oversight of the creators. So anyway, that ending you got with Ashy disappearing from existence moments before the wedding? <laughs> what the fuck, right? <laughs> I mean, technically she should have ceased to exist as soon as Aku was destroyed. Oh, I could go on for hours picking apart the faulty time travel logic. I get it was for dramatic irony, sure, but what, what, what was marriage not bad enough? Haha, <laughs> oh snap. So, because I'm not a big fan of the whole girlfriend who restored your hope slash undone by time paradox slash depression allegory slash bittersweet ending trope, uh, also my grandkids won't shut up about it, I, I figured, hey Rick, you, you, you got a portal gun that lets you hop through all kinds of dimensions, why not help a brother out? After examining all of the universes where Ashi survived, I found some where her Jack died with his fight with Aku. Uh, not a much of a fix for the paradox, but at least it'll keep my stupid grandkids quiet. Wait. Uh. Take this. It is the least I can do for you in return. Szechuan sauce recipe. He does know about fourth wall awareness. 